Cartier 3 2 is the last major construction gap in Dresden's Newmarked area and a gigantic war wound. 258 apartments and 27 office and commercial units will be built in 13 buildings. The site is 9,600 square meters in size. The buildings will be partially reconstructed or given a new classical design. We start first in the neighboring building of the Adler Palast. The dimensions of the palace are enormous. The building is in a league with the Kurlander, Kosel or Taschenberg Palais. The representative staircase is being built in its original dimensions with sandstein details, balusters, rounded corners and niches. The airspace goes up to the ceiling of the Bel Etage, which is around 10 meters. For the details and in order to be able to create the historic exterior wall depths, there are then pre-walls with sand lime bricks inside in the window wall area. The ceiling will still be vaulted with rabbits, as shown in the visualization by Andreas Hummel. The Steinerne Hof can be seen. The passage on the left will remain open at least during the day, so that everyone will be able to get through the Hoim quarter to Landhausstrasse. Later, you will also be able to admire the fantastic fountain. In future, this will not be missing from any guided tour of the city. The upper floor. The visiting room is grandiose in its extent, fortunately, the complete sequence of rooms on the upper floor of the front building has been restored to its historical extent. On the right in the picture is the entrance to the golden balcony. From the main antechamber you have this delicate view of the banqueting hall wing. The view from the exit of the banqueting hall to the front building. The mezzanine floor, where the servants were once housed, is clearly visible. The main antechamber also still has its golden lattice. I'll let the centerpiece of the project speak for itself as much as possible. With the festival hall, a piece of music history is returning and another wonderful event space for the residents of the city. Here, too, the details of the oven niche and the pillars were pre-walled to create the right plasticity. The four round mirrors on the closed sides will return. An outdoor seating area on the garden wing at the Belvedere connection. Since it is as high as the associated story, its dimensions are really huge compared to the doorway. A Baroque quarter greets the Baroque Frauenkirche. The attic will be fully occupied in the future. Maisonettes create really exciting typologies and living forms here. The views are priceless in any case. The flats probably are too. Some construction details of the windows. Here we can guess the later views of the upper apartments. The roofscapes are fantastic. A spolia of the main portal is shown here. Here, too, very beautiful insights. The missing elements were expertly completed. The original fragment can return to its place above the passage. We leave the Hoim via the so-called Wagenremise. It is already a grandiose space. The facades of the first floor zones will be further articulated with optional arch motifs, bossing or greenery. The apartment will be designed as a high pater to allow privacy. A fountain will be added to the courtyard of the Riesk building. In this side courtyard of the north courtyard, for example, three arches will probably be added. On the side wing in combination with the terraces, the dormers are rather averagely detailed. On the other hand, the fire walls were not but washed but nicely covered. The dormers by architect Nofer, on the other hand, are extremely beautiful. The location with a view of the Frauenkirche will be fantastic. View of Rampisha Street Here is a view of the ballroom wing. Let me briefly say something very reassuring about the Adambau. All the historic details of the late Baroque facade will be restored. Here, 
there was only uncertainty due to the visualizations with different display accuracies. The Fashbau will receive the final plaster in the next few days and will be dismantled in a few weeks. Here is a detail of the entrance portal. The completed coat of arms cartouche. If you like my videos then subscribe to my channel here to see my latest videos. If you want to see directly another video then click here. Interesting videos are also available here.